I think yeah. I heard you share recently online something about like financial connection and emotional connection. Yeah. Yeah. Can you explain more about that? Yeah, I think what's happening, unfortunately, men are being indoctrinated into thinking that as long as you provide financially, you can get the hottest girl in the world. And as a result, you, you're a high value man and you, you've made it. But essentially, when you leave with finances, you attract a woman who's emotionally detached. Because emotionally present women, uh, finances does not compensate for lack of quality time. No matter how rich a man is, she wants quality time. Whereas emotionally detached women, they don't care if you're gone for six months on a business trip, as long as they've got a bag and a house and a Rolls Royce and whatever it is. So when you're that man, you're gonna attract that woman. Mm. So you think I'm providing her with everything, she's not gonna go anywhere. She's thinking you provided me with everything, now I can go somewhere. Wow. So you're actually, you, you've lured yourself into a false sense of security. A lot of really successful men will look at a woman and think I've given her everything, she's not gonna go anywhere. She, because she's got external kind of extrinsic value, she's thinking, I've now got everything from this guy. Where do I go next? So what more can I get? What more can I get? From somewhere else. From somewhere else. Holy and God. so unfortunately- it, Why is there not loyalty when a, a, a financially, you know, a stable man is able to provide finances to their partner? Why is that loyalty not there? Because they, the glue of the relationship is broken. Superficial. Yeah, it's superficial. The glue they used was superficial. The glue he the, he's relying on is physical attraction, and the glue she's relying is financial stability. The glue is weak. Whereas if the glue was emotional intimacy, absolutely you can get loyalty. You can't beat emotional intimacy when it comes to loyalty. Once you have emotional intimacy, it, you you really it's very difficult for somebody to be your competition because, because they know you in a way that nobody else can, and you can be vulnerable in a way nobody else can. But when you deprive your relationship of emotional intimacy, every single person is a competition. And this is something these people with junk values don't realize. Wow. Unfortunately.